Hello friends, let's begin with base plan curves. It is similar to Bezier curve where it will help for the characteristic of polygon. Its ability to control the curve shaped locally as compared to global control. Base spline curves allows the local control over the shape of the spline curve. So how it is actually working on? So in first figure if you observe there is an original curve and the shape is shown in the figure where there is a one particular control point is to be changed and it to be modify the shape of the curvature of the curve. So what will happen if you uh, displace that control point from original curve to some slightly below so that curve so that time it will change the shape only in particular form okay while other form of curve will not affect so if you observe the other form of curve on right hand side it will will not affect all the control points are same the shape of the curve is same while those starting curve is little bit change okay while right hand side that is end part of the curve is will not be changed so that will affect due to one local point changes so that is also shown in the last figure where original diagram is shown with a changed diagram so similarly we can move any particular local point and that will change the particular part of the curve and it will be give more flexibility okay it allows to vary the control point without changing the degree of polynomial. So remember, in this case, the degree of polynomial will not change. Only particular path of curve will be changed. Okay. It gives better control over the shape of the curve and it's more complex than Bezier curve. Okay. So here also there are n plus 1 control points. Here we can write the equation of a b-spline curve that is parametric form p of u is equal to summation of i is equal to 0 to n p i n i k u where u varies between 0 to 1 n i k u is uh, the b-spline functions so to avoid high degree polynomials and reduce the global effect the bezier curves are frequently built by connecting several segments of lower degree of curve this permit a local control and the freedom to alter the degree at the expense of continuity. Local control, if one vertex is moved, only some curvature segment, as I mentioned before, are affected and it is rest at the curve remain important, invariant. Okay, that means rest of the curve will not be changed. The curvature in continuity C2 is guaranteed by cubic B spline is preferred as shown in the figure. It is a uniform cubic spline basic function NIT where Ti, Ti plus 1, we have to plot one diagram and from that uniform cubic B spline is plotted. That is Ti plus 2, Ti plus 3, Ti plus 4 and there is a T function on X line and the curvature is given the sum of the segments as shown in the figure that is n03 n13 n23 and n33 from that we have to modify the uniform cubic b spline equation so b spline also uses the blending function of the equation so from that above figure here the blending equation is there its summation of 0 to n pi n i k u 0 u you maximum here i am not reading going to read the whole equation it is little bit tedious okay so you just remember or if you write down the previous that is okay and this one is also simple one if you remember it you can write down in the examination why the not vector here is the not vector so what are the ti ti plus one so t i plus k t k minus r i plus 1 i plus 2 i plus 3 or t t i plus k 
so these are the not vectors of the base plane so base plane of order k sum of the order is k in the span is to be the weighted average of the base plane of order k minus 1 in the ith uh, and i plus 1 uh, spans order k or degree k minus 1 spline is defined as a piecewise k minus 1 degree polynomial that is c k minus 2 continuous like bezier curve b splines satisfy the convex cell property and normalizing property so remember this if it is a convex cell and normal property so n i k t is equal to 1 uniform cubic b spline are the curves with the parametric intervals defined at equal length it is most important the most commonly used scheme in CAD is NUPS that is non-uniform rational B splines non-uniform rational B spline uses non-uniform knot vectors it includes both Bezier curve and B spline curves IGS user NUPS as a standard curve definition for data exchange NUPS uses the additional set of n plus 1 parameters wi called weighted weights to add greater flexibility to curve so that equation is given here the weights here the weighted function is given the weights give the additional degree of freedom to the de design of curves now a non uniform rational b spline is popular because the NURB representation includes all B splines, Bezier's, and conic section. Thank you so much. Hope you understand well.